Hi, I'm Rajiv Parekh from Red. When presented with this option to design something for a charitable cause, uh, we decided to use this uh, as a chance to make sure that the artisans and the craftsmen become the heroes of this story and not us. We've always spoken about on various platforms that we as architects or interior designers or product designers are people who visualize an idea uh, or a product. Um, but it is the craftsman, the artisan, who actually brings it to life. So we thought this was a great chance for them to come into the forefront. Towards that end, we decided that we'll take the act of creation uh, and imprint it with the hand of the artist or the craftsman who works on it. So we created a table which is supported with legs and each leg is created by a different artisan or a craftsman. And once they create the fluted leg, they destroy it by crushing it. And in the process of crushing it, they leave the prints of their hands into the work forever. Furthermore, their names will be etched into each leg. And the fact that a group of craftsmen or artisans together are holding up a table, which then serves different functions. To take it a step forward, we configured the table in a way so that it comes together to create a dining table or a center table, but it can split up in various configurations to become a buffet table, to become something for a study in our current scenario is very relevant. Uh, you can move it around to places, you can stack it up. So this kind of gives it a certain flexibility and it takes away the mammoth dining table, which otherwise is this omnipresent large piece of furniture in a space which cannot be moved around or cannot be changed, even though it does serve a versatile range of functions. Thank you, Isha at Design Pataki for considering us for this particular project. Thank you, Safranat, Ashisha, India Design Fund, all the panelists on it. Specifically, thank you, Orvi, for helping us put together this fabulous looking piece and sharing your work to people and your craftsmen with us.